Alicia and today I'm going to be doing a wig review for Lori's Lemonade Stand, a wig boutique. And I am so excited because today I am reviewing my everyday hair, the hair I wear to work every day when I'm out and about shopping or wherever I may be. I pop this one on because I love this wig. So this is Petite Page by Envy and it is in the color Armoretto and Cream. So when I was originally looking for an everyday hair wear, I don't know if any other people can relate to this, but um, when people find out I wear alternative hair, I feel like they have a tendency to stare right at my hairline to figure out maybe where it starts or where it ends or what's my hair, what's fake hair. Um, but it can be very uncomfortable uh, makes me a little bit self-conscious um so i definitely wanted something that had bangs to mask the hairline and i wanted it to just flow throughout the entire piece nothing too volume heavy on the top or on the bottom or you know distracting with a lot of layers i wanted something very straightforward so as you can tell this is cut as a bob or a page boy hairstyle. I love the bluntness of it and I think it reminds me a little bit of Devil Wears Prada. Um, it's a bit of that timeless look. Reminds me a lot of like the 1940s, but it's very cute. Um, it has this beautiful tri-color highlighting throughout. So you have those bits of blondes and caramelly browns against the dark brown and there are other tricolor highlights versions of this if you want to go more red based blonde based even dark black based and if highlights aren't your thing they also have um lots of solid colors as well um i tend to gravitate towards highlights just because i feel like they brighten up the face and um, personal preference, just think they're really cute. So um, this is synthetic hair. You cannot apply heat products to this. However, I noticed when I wash it with a synthetic uh, shampoo and conditioner, it does dry and form back to its original state in which I bought it. Never had an issue with trying to restyle this. It just kind of goes back to its old ways, which is fine by me. So here you have the bangs here in the front. I tend to move a little bit here, a little bit there, but you can do it however you, you know, you want. Um, and I'm going to do a quick 360 turn so you guys can see what she looks like all around. Okay, so that is what she looks like all around you can see that the cut is very much all the same around very consistent no choppy layers no exaggerated bits it's very cute as is so i'm gonna go ahead and just pop this off so i can talk a bit about the cap itself it is in the cap size petite so if you tend to have a smaller scalp um, and you struggle to find something that fits your head well, this fits me like a glove. Um, it has the adjustable straps on the sides underneath, which I'll show you, but overall it's very secure on my head, which is a must if I'm going to be wearing something every single day in any condition, work or not. Um, uh, there are the bangs here in the front. Again, you can wear them however you want. Um, a little bit more fringy is always cute. I do the side to side. There's that back for you. And you can see all those nice highlights throughout. So as far as um, measurements go, the bangs are four inches. From the crown down, it's gonna be 11 inches. It is chin length. It does not touch my shoulders. It just is right above, which come summer will be really nice to have less hair touching skin. 
And the sides here are 6.5. I just love that definition, so cute. And then you have the nape here in the back, which is obviously a bit shorter, and that is four inches. Another good thing to keep in mind is weight when you are wearing something every single day. You don't want it to be too heavy or too wiggy or too voluminous where it feels, you know, extra heavy. Um, this one here is 3.75 ounces and it just feels very light to me. I enjoy it so much. I'm going to turn her inside out to show you underneath. So you can see that nice expandable stretchy cap. It does fit over the base of my head very easily. Again, you have these adjustable straps. I would recommend if you're wearing something every single day um, that once you have it fitted to a place that it's really secure on your head, you sew these guys down. Um, I haven't done so yet on mine, um, but I definitely will just to have less hassle as they come loose throughout the day of wearing it. You have your ear tabs there. I love that they have these highlights that run through each side of the ear tabs. So when I tuck my hair back, um, I have these nice pretty highlights that run through the sides of my ears. And then the front here, you have that monofilament part. I like that it does not have a distinguished part with this piece. Uh, per se, but you can make that happen. Um, you can also part your bangs however which way you want because you have this nice little um, part here. And so if I throw her back over here inside out, you can see that nice overall look. And I'm just gonna throw her back on real quick to show you what that looks like. Let me sort out my bangs here and give her a quick brush. So, like I said, I tend to do some bangs one way, some bangs the other. Totally up to you. Um, tucking them back, I just want to show you guys what that looks like. Very cute. You can see um, a little bit of existing hair still here. But if you don't, it'll look just as cute. You can probably make this a little bit more fringy or however you want. I'm even um, able to put it up in a little bit of a ponytail if I want in the back throughout the day. Um, I just do a bit of a half or with like um, bobby pins just to give it a little bit more character. I feel like it looks really cute. But as is, is nice as well. It's what drew me to this initially. Is it just looks very timeless. Like the 40s, I feel like. Um, so that is her. I love her. We're good friends every day. Um, if you are interested in checking out the Petite Page, um, by Envy, checking out the other highlighted or bold colors, um, or just finding your everyday piece that you want to wear every day, please check out Lori's Lemonade Stand. If you are in her local area, she's located in Rancho Cucamonga. Um, she's so great. She sits down, will color match your hair. Um, you could tell her your specifics uh, as far as what you're looking for for your everyday hair wig and um, she just tailored mine so perfectly. I, I love wearing it every day. Uh, you can also check out her website, lauries-lemonade-stand.com. You can see other Envy wigs as well as other brands. Um, if you want more visuals and you are on Instagram, you can check out her handle at lauries-lemonade where there's lots of other wig um, options and colors and brands that you can check out. Uh, so thank you guys so much for watching and I'll see you guys in the next one.